What's up guys, I'm Lincoln, and today we're gonna talk about a way to potentially keep your belongings safe when you're at the beach or at a park with this portable safe. Now I'm gonna put this thing through a series of durability tests at the end of the video, so stick around to the end to see if they survive. But if you wanna pick one up for yourself, there will be a link down in the description below. Now this thing is super simple to use. There's a little rubber flap that exposes the dial combination lock. I have the combination set to 1979 because I like that Smashing Pumpkin song. This button opens the unit, so you can see there's nothing in it right now. And this button on the right here undoes the cable so that when you get to the beach, park bench, wherever you're going, the cable comes out like that and it just locks into the unit like that. Now it is tied to whatever you wanna tie it to. There is soft foam on the inside, so theoretically, if you were to drop this, it would protect the belongings that you have on the inside, keeping in mind that the stuff that you're probably putting in this is your phone, your wallet, and probably your car key. I wouldn't say car keys. I have a 12 Pro Max iPhone. I'm able to get that in there pretty nicely. My wallet just kind of sits on top. And then my car key, again, car key, not keys, just kind of fits in on top. I feel like when I'm closing it, I'm it's like the contents on the inside are being squeezed, but they're not gonna go anywhere. This also doubles as a purse. It will fit a few of your items, like the stuff that you need, like your wallet, your phone. The nice thing about phones these days is that you don't typically need to take your wallet with you anywhere because you can buy stuff with your phone. If you have the debit thing set up, you would just need your license or not if you don't, if you're on the run. Not a whole ton of room. My big brain idea is if in order to ward off, you know, the droves and droves of thieves looking to steal your belongings at the beach, these are cheap enough. Buy like four of them and then set up a little game for the thieves to try and figure out which one actually has your belongings. It'll throw them right off. They won't even try, I hope. One thing I know you're gonna ask is how difficult is it to change the combination on it? It's not difficult to change the combination on this at all. Once you have it open, there's a little switch here that if you take uh, a key or a screwdriver or something, you push it forward and then you just change the combination to whatever set of numbers you want. Obviously it's a four, four number combination. So when it comes to you, when you get it from Amazon, the combination is the standard 0000. Like I said at the beginning, I changed it to 1979 just for fun. Overall, I think this is a great little pickup, but what's re what it's really gonna come down to is the durability test and my bolt cutters to see whether or not this cable withstands it. Basically, I was able to break in in under two minutes. It was about a minute 36 seconds. I paused it at 8.24. One minute 36 seconds to cut the cable and then pry this part open with a screwdriver. I did make a significant dent on top with the hammer. It was unnecessary because literally all it took was the screwdriver getting it in there and I got her open. Take what you will from this test. I do think some safety is better than no safety because either you are protecting your valuables and somebody just happens to walk by with a pair of bolt cutters and cut this off the park bench or you're not protecting them and they just kind of scoop up all your crap and leave. So like I said, I do think security is better than no security, but this, maybe there's another option out there. I'm not sure. Like I said, it's cheap enough by four confused the thieves. That's what I would do. Anyway, like this video if you liked it. Please subscribe so you don't miss any of the reviews that we have coming out. There will be an Amazon link if you do want to buy this for yourself down in the description below. I'm Lincoln. Thanks for watching.